Okay, so I was asked the best way, basically, um, to eat ramen. And I would say that the best way to eat ramen is, like, don't eat ramen at all, basically. It's terrible. You should just wait till Whole Foods open. I think it'll be open, like, it's, like, 5 a.m. right now. And, um, it'll be open in a couple minutes at, like, probably, like, 5.30 or 6 o'clock, so... I would just wait until they open and go grazing in the olive section as well as the hot food section which is actually really good but like way too much per pound so I like it's not even stealing if you don't if you carry it on your belly essentially like it's not stealing at all it's basically taste testing and some of us you know taste test until we're full so I, I won't even fuck with the ramen I would just straight up gank some shit at the fucking Whole Foods and call it a day. There's no more to it. Um, or if you've got, like, some neighborhood, like, I don't know, if you're in the South, I think you're in the South. I feel like there are, like, fruit trees and shit around that you can just, like, peel off an avocado off of. And, um, like, that's another way I would do it if I were you. I, I don't live far enough South for, like, fruit trees to be just hanging out. But I would do it like that. Uh, and uh, if you have roommates, like, just sneak their shit, too. And pretend like you didn't do it. Like, I do that all the time. My roommates have no idea that I've eaten pretty much all of their food. And, like, I blame it on mice or, like, house guests or even fucking ghosts. Like, they have no proof at all. Like, and I'm fine with that. So, I think, yeah, you don't need to eat ramen. I think there are a couple alternative ways to like go about eating food like if you're a dumpster diver then you can like do that i'm against it i'm like whatever but um you can do that and you probably pull out a whole fucking salmon mm, that's all i have to say on that okay bye